Hello, I am Air Force Veteran Ed Ruckel from Veteran Facilitator, where keeping you informed is my passion. Today I'm going to introduce you to the End of Life Annuities Record. Yep, another one of those records you got to have in that legacy book. But before I do, just to let you know, if you like what I'm doing, click on that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video, and let's get started. So what is an annuity? Well, I'm no financial genius, okay, but I can tell you what I know. An annuity is any income you receive after you retire. I don't know if it includes everything, but definitely it includes some things. And you would say, well, uh, well, the only thing I have coming in is that small check from my employer. That's an annuity. Uh, well, I got Social Security. That's an annuity. Well, I get a retirement check from the military. I served 25 years. Yep, that's an annuity. That's why you need this form. Well, here I am on the annuities record. I'll include a link to this record down below the video in the description area. And uh, let's get started here. Walk you through some of the high points. Right up here at the top is your annuities, government and private. Uh, you enter in your name, monthly amount, city, phone, zip code, that sort of thing. Down here is your employer membership. So if your employer is going to be paying you or because you work for a, a company and uh, you're going to get that, I've received my, my annuity, not a lot of money because I didn't work there that long, but I do have a check coming in every month after I retire. So you want to make sure you list the employer, you list your survivor benefits, uh, and then a zip code, state, etc., phone numbers, etc., who to call. That's really important, okay? Uh, next one down, membership and organizations, list of organizations which you're affiliated with. And you would say, well, what's that got to do with the annuity? Well, I don't think much, but it does have something to do with honor guards and getting uh, buried and uh, being recognized for your service. And we're going to have to do a separate video on that, okay? I know it sounds a little confusing, but it is what it is. And the Veteran Records of Affairs, uh, and what you want to do is jot down this number. This should be on your speed dial, number 1, 1-800-827-1000, because after your death, your spouse is going to be left holding the bag. She needs to know who to call, and that is one of the biggies, okay? Next thing down here is your VA claim numbers, if any. Uh, Social Security, you know, where is your nearest Social Security office? What's your Social Security amount that you're receiving? And the location of your papers for Social Security, if you have to prove uh, anything. And finally, down here, your retirement checks, civilian and or military. And, of course, you want to document the financial center and uh, the location amount where it's being deposited, beneficiaries, unpaid retirement, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, relationship and phone numbers. And don't forget, if you have additional information that's not shown on this form, but you want to add it to this form, uh, then go ahead and uh, use that additional form at the bottom uh, on my uh, website. Just download it, okay? And I'll do a video on that one anyway, so you'll always have the record. Well, this completes the presentation. From the information presented, you learned about the end-of-life annuities record. You learned what an annuity is. You learn that your retirement pay from the military, your Social Security check, and your employer retirement is all considered an annuity. Till next time, have yourself a great day.